Katz. I'm here with David from the Humane Society of St. Lucie County, and we got both today. Yeah, we got a dog and a cat today. I'm going to start with the uh, kitten. Okay. This is Sonia. Miss Sonia. She came in as a stray. Unfortunately, there was no mama, so we had to bottle feed her from a very early age. Oh, wow. But she's big, strong, and healthy. How does she, she respond to other people there? Oh, great. I mean, you know, we pretty much raised her from two weeks old, so um, she loves people. It's almost like she, she wants to crawl up and almost sit on your shoulder, almost like a little like parrot almost. Yeah. Oh, she's um, loving she's the very camera attached right now. to people. And um, she really attaches herself to young children as well. When people are in there, volunteers are in there, and they bring their kids in and play with the kittens. She just loves kids. Really? I can tell. She's, she's been very playful ever since we got her out here. Yes. And who she's, else do we have down there? And this is Calvin. Calvin. And Calvin is... Calvin Harris? Calvin Harris, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's not as good as a, uh, a singer or anything like that. But uh, he does love the pool. He loves to, you know, he'll love a good beach day. Um, he loves to splash around the kiddie pool that we have, loves playing with tennis balls. He's very curious, as I you can see, see with all this. I see his tennis ball things. that he brought out here <laughs> with us, too. And, um, you know, his best feature is his smile. I mean, anybody who sees him is just like, this is the most handsome dog I've ever seen. And we're hoping that he captures somebody's heart out there and uh, they'll come in and adopt him. Oh, we hope so, too. And, you know, we were talking about this. Uh, we warned, you know, pet owners the 4th of July is a time yes. animals get scared. Sometimes mm -hmm. people lose their pets as you guys see an influx. Uh, of strays come in after Absolutely. the 4th. Absolutely. And uh, we, we just got bombarded this, especially every, every 4th of July with uh, strays, animal control coming in, you know, people just don't keep their pets inside for whatever reason. And uh, it's always a good time to remind people to get your pet microchipped. Mm. Um, and if you do have your pet microchipped, call the provider. You can go to a vet's office or any local humane society. They can scan, find the chip number, give you the number to the provider. Make sure that your chip is up to date with your information. Because I can't tell you how many times an animal comes in. We're thrilled that it's microchip, but it leads back to nobody. A disconnected phone number. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, that is handy information. And I think I may need to go check on that with my own little pooch at home. Okay, anything else that we should know? I hope that you find... 